Uh, oh, sorry, sorry about that. Uh, I lost battery power, so I've had to uh, start another video. Try and pick up where I left off. I forgot what I was saying. I think I was saying something like uh, my choice, my preference, preference living or staying here. Uh, oh. Hold on, let me just turn this camera around. There's, there's Rebecca. She's playing in the river. What do you think, Rebecca? What do you think to this place? Freezing! Yeah, what do you think to it though? It's good. It's nice? Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. Looking forward to tonight? What? Looking forward to tonight? Yes. Very I good. I want to eat some crab, but I can't find it. Have you found any crab yet? No. Oh. We'll I need to I need to eat some crab tonight, so keep on looking. Really? Yeah. I want you to help me. In a minute, I will do. Okay. So. Finish the video help okay? Okay, okay. So yeah. Yeah, we love it. Ah, uh, see ya. I just want to show you something. Uh, I don't know if you can see it. The other side of that river bank, that blue pipe, that water pipe. Now I don't know where that goes, but it's it, it's it's feeding it's feeding uh, water supply somewhere, and and this place has got its own water supply as well. And I'm just going to show you what I'm talking about. Let's go up here. Uh, what they do is, further up the river, there's a big, oh, one knows what that were. It's like, it's like a celebrity getting out of here. <laughs> Spiders. Yeah, uh, I'm just going to show you what I mean. Further up the river, there's a big waterfall. Big waterfall. And that blue pipe, water pipe, it sits in the middle of that waterfall and it just it's collecting all the water and it obviously because it's high up and this is low down we've got, we've got pressure water pressure and I'll show you in a minute to that all, all them uh, strawberry crops and I'll show you what I mean with, with water pipes now this let me just spin camera on again okay so this water pipe here Comes down to this little unit here, and let me just show you the back of the this one. Show you inside there. That is, I don't know if you can see that, but that that motor there, that motor, that's from a car. That's out, out of a car, that motor. And what's happening is the, the pressure from the water is spinning. That motor down, and then that motor is this is an electric cable here. That, like, that motor is providing electricity, and my battery just went as we're filming. And believe it or not, I've just recharged it by plugging it in. I'll just show you. Yeah. Plugging it in. Yeah, that's my laptop. And that's the charger. And it's plugged in there. Look. That's friggin' unbelievable. Amazing, eh? Middle of nowhere. And we've got electricity created, being generated from that river down there. Now, this water pipe runs all the way along here. If you can see all these strawberry crops here, the same water feed, the pipes are running all the way down and all it does is feeds all those crops with water. Friggin' amazing, yeah? Yeah. This is the pipe and it runs up and up and up and up and up. Out there. 
to that waterfall and the pressure of the water comes down. Awesome. Now I'm going to spin this camera around again. Probably be a long video of this, but I don't, I don't care because I just want to just want to show you this how amazing this place is and you know why I just love it. And I'll tell you the reason, real reason why we've come here, shall we? The real reason why we've come here is because I'm just going to come show you down here. There's a, I'll show you this grapevine. And the, the real reason why we've come here is because Kaz, my other off, she wants to do something. Uh, she's, you know, she's twiggling the thumbs. I mean, I'm working, I'm making a living for, for a pair of us. But she wants to do something. And she's uh, come up with this idea uh, for tourists. And what she wants to do is organise trips. And this is just one of them, what she's kind of wants to organise. Because uh, people love this kind of stuff. And the owner of this uh, this farm, if you like, this is this is a great mine here. Look at this. Uh, great mine. Grapes. Look at them. Lots and lots and lots and lots of grapes. And pretty awesome. Just amazing. Amazing place. And even though it's it's quite pleasantly warm, very warm. But tonight I've been told get ready because it will get chilly. I just wanted to show you that grapevine. Anyway, going back to what why we here is because Kaz wants to organise trips like this, and this is just one what she's uh, trying to sort out. Her and a friend, they started their own business up and kind of tourist adventure uh, trips and this is one of them so because people love this kind of stuff and the owner of this place he's agreed to to let the people come here and stay in that little room that little uh, room side of the river I've just showed you that's where we're staying tonight uh, come here and stay there and the owner is going to show them the basics the, you know the basics how to survive in this kind of environment making tools and making stuff from uh, bamboo from bamboo making tools and how, how you can you know survive off the land the basic stuff uh, cooking you know it's cooking on a natural campfire and all really great educational stuff and like I said people love it I certainly do so that's why we were and that's what she wants to do and this is just one of them and she's got loads of other projects uh, of uh, different adventures that people can choose to go on and uh, that, that, that that's what she's got planned and I think it's I think it's a fantastic idea myself and uh, I can't see it being a fail to be honest because hey, look at it come on it's not everybody's cup of tea I know but it's certainly mine so yeah uh, <laughs> if you want to do something like this and you uh, ever in this uh, this area of Thailand then um, by all means get in touch with me and uh, I'll organise it for you like I say there's loads of stuff we can sort out for you this is just this is just a new one and it's uh, it's not even started yet but that's the plan and I think it's a good Good idea. See? 
the people here are so friendly. Yeah, I don't know what they're doing, but they're working some of that. They're picking some fruit. They're waving to me. Yeah. That's it. living off the land. All we, all we do is, you know, there's no TV in that out here. Yeah. We die us, we didn't have TV to watch. Silly in it really. It's crazy, because when you go back, this is where we all come from really, the roots. Been back thousands and thousands of years ago, this is how we all used to live. But over the years obviously, it's, a, it's become the norm to have the luxuries we've got now. But, uh, like I say, I love this, I love this uh, life I've got. I just, I just love it. It's absolutely amazing. And it's all thanks to the internet, down to technology, see? It's all thanks to that, making a living off online, being able to do this kind of stuff. And, uh, uh, you know, like less than 12 months ago, I was slugging, slugging my guts out for somebody else. And uh, look at it now, I think I've just totally changed it. And anybody can change their life. It's all down to preference, it's all down to what you want to do, it's all down to your mindset, and it's all down to believe. You've got to believe in yourself and you've got to work out what you want out of life. Simple as that. Now, what I want out of life, I'm making it happen. I want to work, work and make a living online and I'm doing that. And Kaz, my other half, she wants to do this. Uh, this kind of stuff. And she's determined she will do it. And take my hat off to her. She will do it. The point is, what do you want? Okay, catch you later. I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry for the length, length of the video. And I'm sorry at to it was cut into two parts, but like I said, a battery guide on there. But I was saved by the river. Okay. See you later.